Champs accidentally released his pair early on their website and I was able to cop three pairs for retail. Here we have the Air Jordan Retro 2 High Chicago. This is a grade school pair that yes, you guys heard it first, Champs released early on the website. I was notified from Twitter that there's a link for I believe it was either like Soul Links or Sneaker Twitter and there was a link to this specific shoe and I was able to check out. I think it was must have been like an error or an accidental like they put the um, the shoe online for sale accidentally early and people were able to check out and they actually shipped to my house. We are about, about I say one to two months early. I think this pair is scheduled to um, release either in November or December. The date is still undetermined, but here we have it, the Jordan 2 Retro Chicago. We've been having a ton of Jordan 2s releasing throughout the year from lows to highs, from collaborations, from about a bunch of huge just like brands and everything but the chicago is a classic guys i i personally do i like the highs and stuff but the lows are just way better the lows for jordan 2s are just overall like just cleaner to me i do like high tops that's kind of like the same thing for dunks i'm more of a dunk low and jordan 2 low type of guy and stuff i like my low top like shoes and stuff sneakers that are like higher crop and everything like the high tops they're cool and all, but you know what? It's just harder to wear and just harder to style overall. So in today's video, we are going to be reviewing this pair right here, going over everything you need to know about it before you find out more about it. You know, it's still a little bit early, guys. A lot to be, like, too determined. Release date may get pushed back. It's definitely going to be right around the holidays. Super good pair right here. This is a grade school. They only release grade school on champs early. No men's, but there will be, I think, full family sizing or at least grade school and men's sizing when the full release date is publicly announced and everything. So in today's video, we're going to be reviewing it, you know, sizing, material, quality, the colors, resale predictions, how to cop it, maybe a little bit of that just because it is a little bit early, but definitely the generic websites and in store as well. So before hopping to the video, guys, make sure you like, comment, subscribe. My name is Anthony Attila. I post every single day on this channel, guys. Whether it's a YouTube short, a, a longer video like this one right here, I'm bringing you guys. We will cover from everything, the newest, the latest, and the earliest sneakers like this one right here. Unboxings, reviews, how to cops, investments, everything. Bringing you guys the latest and greatest content. So let's get right into the shoe. But first off, guys, start off the box. The box is a little disappointing. Got the black and gold box. Classic kind of for like grade school Jordans. Size 5.5. I also have two size fives as well. Retail on this pair right here is $140. I'm not too sure about men's retail, but I would assume at least $200 because that's what the previous Jordan 2s were kind of like, you know, releasing at throughout the year. Size five and a half grade school, guys. Take out the other shoe. No clap, or just a classic tissue paper. Nothing crazy, nothing special. The box is a little disappointing again. But the shoe definitely makes up for it, guys. Look at it. The details, the tumble leather, the nice pure soft leather, the riddles in the back, the details from the red, and just the overall balance from the white to the black really just part the shoe really well. Here are the bottoms and everything. One thing I do like about Jordan 2s, it has the sizing on the outer sole. It's right there, right in that black. 5.5 a lot of other shoes or pretty much no other shoes except for jordan 2s do this i think it's super smart so when people ask you what size you wear or just it's easier to look at rather than like looking inside the shoe the size tag for the shoe is in that inner pocket right there it has all your information right there guys my favorite probably part of the shoe is like this tumble leather it kind of looks like this like animal print or like a crocodile and then especially the little holes right here that kind of just break up the leather just kind of adds a little bit more of like attention to it and just overall focus super clean nice deep kind of like holes the stitching is very crisp for this pair right here you can see right here black laces to top it off i think the black laces really just do a really good job of complementing it because you have a lot of white leather on it and then your red accents on the toe or the tongue right here with the wings super clean with the black edges looks super sharp guys nice cushion around the ankle and the back around the heel super cushiony with this nice black and then your insole is in a nice black with the nike sign your lace is there your shoe tree is in there as well the back got the nice riddles super sharp in this nice like plastic or it's a rubber feel actually and then 
you can see it, the Nike right there, super sharp right there, guys. The red, and then more of that red on the outer soles, super clean. Really does a great job of balancing the colors from the red to the white to the black. You name it, guys. This is the Chicago Jordan 2 Retro High Classic, guys. This is a must cop. Let me know in the comments, are you guys looking to pick up this pair? Retail again for the grade school is about 140. This shoe will also be a general release sneaker, meaning that a bunch of retailers will have them both in store and online. So there'll be a lot of raffles going on, lots of chances to cop. I believe Nike sneakers um, stock numbers will be quite high for this pair. And everyone that wants them should be able to get their hands on them. And resale price, on the other hand, is still a little bit soon to tell. I feel like a lot of people still really don't know that these are coming out just yet yeah, still a little bit early i also do wonder how many people copped on champs so let me know in the comments if you were able to pick up an early pair on champs for retail this was a super cool opportunity because really this stuff really doesn't happen it does sometimes on certain shoes and different websites but i really just kind of caught this one i was able to pick up three pairs not just one so it's also a big w on that aspect so thank you all so much for watching guys my name is anthony Otillo. i appreciate you all so much for watching the video if you stayed until the end, I'm doing a giveaway pretty soon, guys. Let me know in the comments what shoe I should give away. I'm 150 subscribers away from 2,000 subscribers, guys. You heard it. Let me know in the comments. One winner will be chosen out of how many entries. It really doesn't matter. It'll be posted on my Instagram at Anthony Got Souls in the next week to two. I'm still trying to come to conclusion what shoe I should give away. Let me know in the comments. I'll see you guys tomorrow with more heat. Peace.